Hello Libra and welcome to your June 2022 forecast. My name is Lisa from It's Practical Magic. Thank you so much for joining me today. I'm so grateful and so glad that you are here. We're going to be taking a look at um, the beginning, middle, and end of the month of June for you here. Um, and I am an intuitive reader of runes, tarot, and oracle cards. Today we're going to be using some oracle cards. And I'm also really excited to be adding on a chakra card as well, an astral house forecast for you for the month of June. Uh, if by chance you're looking at more information in regards to um, the chakra deck that I'm using. I actually did an unboxing on my channel as well not too long ago. Uh, it was the first unboxing I actually did on YouTube. I had so much fun with it and um, yeah if you would like to see more of those just let me know and we can definitely look at doing more unboxings as well in the future. Um, if you are by chance also looking for a free reading I do go live every Tuesday, Thursday and Sunday on Twitch. Um, and all you need to do is just come join the queue. I would absolutely love to give you a free reading there. Um, and of course, if you're looking to book a private session, um, I would absolutely love to read for you also. Um, so yeah, let's get started and see what's going on here for you, Libra. We're going to take a look at the beginning, middle, and the end of the month, of course, followed by your, your chakra message. Very curious to see what's going on here for you. But I hope that you have been doing well. And uh, for those of you who are returning, thank you for joining me again. And for those of you who are new to the channel, it's really, again, so lovely to meet you and have you here. Um, let's, oh, let's see what that's all about. All right. I am loving, loving, loving this deck. I, yeah, <laughs> I'm so grateful to have it. All right. Let's see what we have for the Astral House, of course, as well. Oh, we got a little bit of a squeaky chair. There we go. And all right. Let's, let's get started and see what's happening for you. All right, so we have the beginning of the month. Oh, very nice. Very nice. Libra, so we have money coming in. This is all about money. This is all about you being able to finally pay off that loan that you've been hoping to pay off or, um, you know, if you were hoping to purchase a vacation for yourself or family, do some traveling, uh, looking to purchase a new vehicle, looking to purchase new uh, computer, new, <laughs> like you name it, the money is going to be there for you. So um, if by chance you were kind of wondering like, oh, I really want to get this thing and oh, or kind of like just feeling discouraged because you haven't been able to purchase something or, you know, actually go do something something you were hoping to do because of financial um, circumstances, that is going to change. We're already seeing this at the beginning of June. So hang tight with that. I feel like it's not just one thing. There's a few, um, a few opportunities that you're going to be able to do. So say, for example, like going back to like paying off a loan, you know, you're going to have the opportunity to do so, but you're also going to be able to have the opportunity to do again, something else with this abundance that is finding its way to you. Um, yeah, so enjoy. <laughs> I mean, like, yeah, it, it's nice. It's uh, who who doesn't want more abundance <laughs> in their life, right? And also to have that weight lifted from your shoulders of being able, like, oh, finally, like, finally, I'm, I'm able to pay off that that student loan or credit card or that car payment or whatever. Like, finally, it's also that that could be the connection too. You know, if you paying that off, that you have like you're freeing up that extra income in addition to the additional <laughs> abundance. Like, you have some really nice money headed your way. Okay, so if you're feeling frustrated or wondering where it is, hang tight. <laughs> hang tight. Look at also the connection, the colors with that chakra card. That is quite something. Wow. All right. We'll see. We'll see what that's all about in a little bit. Um, so the middle of the month, we have courage. Hmm. Okay. So I feel with this extra money coming in, you have been toying with the idea of starting like your own business or, um, say perhaps you have your own business and you kind of want to take it to the next level, or, you know, you're wanting to make some investments, some real estate investments or whatever. Again, this is, this is a general read, take what resonates of course, and leave what does not. Um, or perhaps you're looking at, you know, with love that you want to propose and you're like, well, I want to go, you know, buy a ring or I want to do this, or I want to, you know, create this extremely romantic situation. <laughs> <laughs> like I have no idea, but I feel like you need to um, take that risk, you know, and and actually get things going here. So um, what is the step involved? Say, for example, with like the whole proposal thing, what what do you need to do to set up that scenario that you want to create? Right. 
start start planning things out start like you know um taking a look at like where you need to go who you have to contact things like that say for example you're looking at um you know, wanting to uh, venture out and start your own business. Well, you know, yes, there's the the general like, you know, go to's that you need to do when you start a business. But what are perhaps some of the things that you might not generally think of? So really just to be very thorough in a sense in preparing, preparing um, yourself, because this is going to also give you that courage, right? When you feel like you have kind of like that secure energy of uh, that, that secure Libra energy of like, okay, I, I have all this taken care of. Okay. I can look at this. I can do that. I can, you know, it's like, you're, you're then really ready to leap through this portal, to take this chance, to take this risk. So this is really nice. I like this for you. Um, like already like looking to be such a nice and also like a very exciting month. It's very adventurous. I feel um, perhaps again, because you have like the exposure to those funds that perhaps you wouldn't necessarily always have maybe there's an extra holiday pay coming in like i don't know <laughs> from work so here we have closure hmm. okay so i feel like this is definitely involving a particular person and i feel like this person um is like they you're, you're making this shift you have you have come into this abundance and it's like they are not really um happy for you it's like they're putting on a fake front you know like oh that's wonderful yeah yay you know but it's like as soon as they like they're behind closed doors they're like oh you know why does it always happen to them or why can't it happen to me or so anyway <laughs> i feel like this courage as well we had like you know the the energy being channeled of like what you're able to do to take action for like you know business and monetary things but also it's giving you the energy to say I think it's time to say goodbye to some people, you know? And the thing is like when we're saying goodbye, this actually came up in another uh, signs read today as well. It's like some of those people, you know, they will, once you walk away, they, they might not ever reappear in your life again, but others might kind of see you and have a newfound respect for you and know that there are these boundaries that you have kind of set up to protect yourself or to give yourself the life that you're deserving of. Um, and they may also like have that respect and come back to you eventually. But for the time being, you're really being encouraged to walk away from anything or anyone who does not serve you continuing this path. All right. And you know, you know who these people are. Like, it's just your intuition is there's an intense radar for that right now. So honor this as well. It's it's happening for a reason. Don't ignore the energy and signs that you're receiving towards these people or person. Um, okay. So the chakra, look at this, listening. Yeah. <laughs> are, are you listening? <laughs> <laughs> Libra, are you listening? So we have um, the throat chakra here that is being <laughs> channeled here for you. And again, like you're being shown the way for this particular situation, you know, come the end of the month, you're being really guided and shown the way like to be like, hey, you can do this. Like there's these opportunities, you have to get some planning and some you know, some things set in, in, in motion, but you got this, let's go. And then also, hey, relax wherever you are right now or whenever you're watching this because the money is is there it's going to appear and it's not just say for example you're watching this or you come across this uh read um you know end of june it's like this money it's so abundant it's trickling through the entire month so it's not just you're receiving this sum of money like at the beginning of the month you know um so this is like i feel also a continuous thing but also for two to be continuous and to like flourish and grow because that is so healthy like very strong abundance you know, you need to honor and embrace this. You need to honor and embrace this. You need to be listening. <laughs> you need to be listening. Here we have, the, I mean, there you go. I, yeah. <laughs> how how much money did you want to get this monthly, Libra? Because it's like, it is raining coins. <laughs> like gold coins. It's raining lots and lots of money here for you. Um, so this is just a confirmation. Like, I mean, you had this already in your read quite a bit but it's just saying you know if you are again stressing or worrying or having to like be like oh my gosh how am I going to pay this bill how am I going to do this or where is this you know I've been doing the money spells <laughs> I've been doing like whatever where is it it's it's on the way okay it is on the way 
Um, be open to receive it though. That's also really important and give that gratitude back when, once you do. Um, so yeah, that, that is what I have for you for the month of June Libra. Thank you so, so much for joining me. I'm already looking really forward to see what July has in store for you. Take good care.